Drive is a cluster of innovative technologies which assist the driver to navigate the roads better. So Ogilvy's idea was to use this concept of a video game and show the new polo navigating the absolutely crazy streets of Johannesburg in the metaverse or the Mzanziverse as we like to say. So from dodging potholes and taxis to load shedding at the traffic lights, our, our main character heroine uh, cleverly beats the game using the IQ Drive technologies. Then hidden in the ad over and above this were 100 NFTs, which we ran a little competition on and users um, had the opportunity to identify them over a five day period and actually win these, these um, NFTs. So this is our first dabble in the metaverse. And I must say the response to the campaign has been absolutely unprecedented. So I think my advice to other brands in starting their journey with the metaverse would be to just make sure that it organically fits into a campaign structure that you're already engaging in and to always make sure that your brand's authentic self is represented, even if you're in the metaverse. So I think on the African continent, the three top trends in the, in the next little while that will impact us will be automation, e-commerce, and branded content. So automation, specifically AI, I think will have particular impact for small and medium-sized businesses who don't yet have the resources to complete repetitive tasks that a bot could do better. So this would include technologies like chatbots where customers can have really quick but extremely meaningful interactions with our brands. So that was automation. Then the second one would be e-commerce. E-commerce is already quite big um, in South Africa, but it's going to get even bigger. People wanting the hankering after more and more convenience and improved safety and security. So security in, in, in shopping is quite important here. So the rise of different blockchain, um, different cryptocurrencies and different payment gates like Snapscan, Zapper, et cetera, there's a lot of potential for brands to innovate and conquest new customers who are attracted by instant gratification. Then the third one was branded content. So our ad avoider audiences are growing and growing. Consumers are actively blocking adverts um, and content, branded content is a space where brands can really play um, in trying to entertain and create meaningful connections with their potential customers. So at my session at VMF South Africa, I'm going to talk about how brands can use social media to build their brand successfully using the Polo NFT campaign and a couple of others, uh, other Volkswagen um, examples.